Okay, class, um, I'm going to show you guys. There's been in past semesters a lot of people that have issues with um, installing Pygame and Pygal. Um, so this is a video how to do this real quick. Um, first thing you want to do, um, open up one of these um, file explorer windows. Now, this should work for just as long as you just follow the basic Python installation. If this doesn't work, get a hold of me and we'll figure it out. Um, but what we need to do is we need to find, um, this video is for Python version um, 8, I believe. So um, first thing you do, you go to your C drive and you'll have a users folder. You go into the users folder. Now my username is mcle5. The only thing different about this that you're gonna have is your username is gonna be different. So you're gonna to have to go in your users folder and find whatever your username is. So I'll go in here. Now for this next one, um, the folder doesn't exist in here so you have to manually do it. So go in here and do a uh, slash and do app data. Okay, once you're in app data, then you go to local, scroll down until you find programs, and then you should see Python, and then Python 38-32, so that's the folder that you'll need. So then you go up here and you click the yellow folder, okay, that will highlight um the <laughs> directory that you want to get to so you control c that to copy it so control c and then um let's see here you go in and you type cmd and open up the command prompt and you'll do cd space and then control v to paste that and you'll press enter that will move you to the proper python folder now again um, I, I do believe I'm on, let me look at this real quick, IDLE, this is for Python 3.8, so it's not Python 8, 3.8, but you can see 38-32, so 38 version, and it's 32-bit. My guess is that's what you guys have if you downloaded that. Um, and so now all we do is with the instruction sheet, that I'll, I'll email to you guys, but at the same time, you can just watch this and follow along. Uh, whoops, that's PyGal. We'll do that in a second, but we'll do this one first. <clears throat> you got to run some pip codes. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to click on that, control C it. It might not, mine might be a little bit different because I've already installed it, but uh, copy that in there and press enter see what happens here again since I've already installed mine um, requirement already up to date so mine's already up to date um, but when you install yours you'll get this screen right here with this uh, installation bar running it should go to 100% and give you something that looks a little bit like this okay um, next what you can do scroll down on this and this is the next one install let's see here and again my mine might be a bit different because I've already installed that but Python space dash M space pip space install space Pygame see what happens here so I control V that and enter uh, already satisfied so um, and then well this should work the final thing to test is this if you can get this alien game to pop up then you know that it's installed properly so I'll just press enter okay. so, you guys can play it's actually kind of a fun game it's like old school uh, old school Galaga or something so um, anyway as long as you get that uh, aliens game installed properly it works um, and so the last one you'll need is pygal so here are the pygal instructions and um, 
Only thing you need here is this pip code. So control C that and paste that there and then press enter. Uh, installing collected package successfully installed. Okay, so this should help walk you through everything. Um, I don't know there in this installation uh, guide. There are instructions for anybody on Linux um, or um, Apple, and I don't have either one of those, so I can't demonstrate that. But um, if you got one of those, we might have to walk through it together, like on a WebEx meeting. But this should work for everybody. So. <coughs>